Namaskaram Shashi Tharoor. The burden of the fuel tax imposed by the central government and also by many state governments ruled by the BJP and other parties is proving unsustainable for the Ahmadni. It's unconscionable, for example, that Indians are paying 260% tax on their fuel, while Americans, for instance, pay 20%. Fuel taxes affect all other prices. For the Ahmadmi, a pair of slippers or, or a shirt also costs more because it has to be transported from a factory to the shop where he buys it from using fuel that the government is taxing out of existence. The problem with this government is it doesn't seem to understand that the short-term gain of taxes hurts the economy in the long term. On top of that, what they have done is based completely on extortion. As global prices went down from a peak of $140 during UPA rule per barrel, down to as low as at one point around $30 a barrel and now stabilizing in recent months in the 50s and low 60s per barrel, the Indian tax system has kept on raising prices with the result that the government is dipping its hands into your pocket in order to fulfill its own financial priorities rather than yours. This must stop. We must have a return to the public of their money by slashing the taxes on fuel, both center and some states. The Congress rule government in Rajasthan has cut its own taxes. The central government has refused to do so. The time has come to demand an end to the fuel tax loot.